How to find or switch your career path. Meet Bob. Bob found his career path and he would like to share five tips with you. Number one, assess yourself. You need to learn about yourself. It is helpful to understand your passions, interests, skills, traits, abilities, and qualifications. What types of challenges are you looking for? Although it may seem a bit silly, try a personality test or career assessment. These tools can be very useful in helping you understand your own personality and what careers you could look at. If you are looking for a career change, assess your current job satisfaction. What do you enjoy and dislike about your current career? Is it the company culture, environment, or the people you work with? Is the job too boring or too challenging? Try and answer these questions as they can help you set your goals for your new career. Number two, research possible careers. Don't be afraid of spending a lot of time researching. Take your goals into consideration and explore the growing job market. You can read articles or watch videos about careers that will have good future prospects. Number three, make a list and compare. Make a list of career options that you would like to research at a deeper level. Then begin to evaluate each option. Assess all the benefits and potential or median salary for that field. When you are planning your career, you should take into consideration the location and the commuting options available. Some areas will offer more opportunities for a career, while others may not have as many options. What commuting options do you have in your city, or are you planning on moving elsewhere for your career? These are questions you should consider when you are choosing your career path. You can then begin to eliminate some of your options. If anything on the list is no longer appealing, then cross it off. And take any careers off your list that would be impossible for you to fulfill its qualifications. Number four, establish your goals and plans. Once you have your final decision, you can set your goals. Create a list of short and long-term goals that you would like to achieve in the future. You can use the SMART method to develop your goals. SMART stands for specific, measurable, obtainable, relevant, and time-based. When creating your goal, be specific and concise. What do you want to accomplish? Where is it located? Which resources or limits are involved? If you aspire to be a doctor like Bob, set a specific goal such as earning your medical doctor degree so that you can work at your local hospital as a cardiac surgeon. Measure your progress. For example, set a goal to finish your medical doctor degree in four years. Make sure this goal is achievable and realistic. Do you have the time to complete this goal? Are there any financial limits? Think of all the steps you will need to take in order to achieve this goal. Is this goal relevant? This career should matter to you and it should also help you in your overall career development. Establish deadlines or target dates for your goals. Having a deadline will help you keep yourself motivated and accountable. But be sure your deadlines are realistic. For example, Bob set his goal to earn his medical degree in four years. Number five, try it out. Before putting all your time, money, and effort into a new career, give it a try. There are many different ways you could do this. You could find educational opportunities that expand and connect your current knowledge to your new career. Attend an evening class from a local college or try a weekend seminar. You could also find the course online. Investigate volunteer or freelance opportunities that target your interest and career field. Set up a shadow job. The best way to try it out is by shadowing professionals who work in that field. You will be able to observe what they do on a daily basis and get a feel for the work environment. As you follow around the employee, you could be asked to help with different tasks and as a result, learn new skills. During and or after the experience, you could also be given a chance to ask questions.